I'm Cher Russell for mining.com.au and joining me today is Paul Harbage, the president and CEO of Faraday Copper. Paul, it's great to see you. How are you? Yeah, I'm very good, Che. As always, great to speak to you today. Now, I am super thrilled to be talking to you today and the nerdy geologist in me is going to have a great time. You've gone from Beaver Creek to the core shed at your Copper Creek project. Uh, tell me, where exactly are you? Yeah, Shay, I'm in San Manuel, which is a, a base of operations for Copper Creek. And I'm in the core shed this week looking at a new core from the you know, new discovery of the Banjo Breccia. Uh, listen, Paul, it's not every day investors get a chance to see in, inside a core shed. Is there any chance you could take us on a bit of a tour? Yeah, certainly, Shay. Let's we'll go a walk through. And um, what I want to do is I'll just, we'll just turn around here. And so we've got a big metal door here that, that opens up. The core comes through here. And then it actually goes onto these roller tables that you can see here. And it really makes it easy for, for the team to work on it. And then as we walk through, so the core comes in, it, it gets laid out on these roller tables. This is where they do all the logging and the sampling. And then you know, we've got a much bigger room here for, for, and you can see all the core laid out on these tables. And then it ultimately comes through into what is the cutting room. And this is where we have two automatic core saws that the, the, the core is put through, it cuts it up, it then gets sampled and then chipped off to the laboratory. And in addition, we've got another big room here, you know, great environment for the geologists to work in, you know, all uh, brand new, we've, we've fully renovated it, we've got all these um, high definition lighting, as I say, these tables and all the cores laid out. So, you know, fantastic facility for the team to really unlock the value from Copper Creek. Now, for everybody who might not have been inside a core shed before, why are core sheds important in the process of exploration to development? Well, this is where once, the, once uh, we collect the core from the draw rig, it comes down here to be marked up, uh, logged, and then sampled, and obviously then ready to go off to the lab for the assay results. So it's really the, uh, the beating heart of the operation. Now, you just mentioned that you're here checking out the core from your recent banjo discovery. Uh, tell us, what are you looking at right now? Yeah, no, so, you know, this is a new breccia pipe. Um, you can see the clasps that are then cemented with the charcoal pyrite, which is this brassy colored metal here. And charcoal pyrite is the main copper mineral in the Copper Creek project. And this hole, this is a discovery hole number 70. It was 200 and 70 meters at 0.64% copper and included with that was a high grade intercept of 118 meters at a percent copper. So, you know, high grade results, really exciting. And there's more drilling happening as we speak and more results to come. Um, while you're still drilling around Banjo, how many more meters of drilling do you expect to do? So we, we plan to, well, we've got about another 13 to 14,000 meters to drill as part of this program. So uh, plenty more. We've got a, a second rig coming to site shortly as well, which will expedite drilling not only in um, the American Eagle area, but on targets outside of that, uh, particularly up at Rum, as well as you know, old reliable Area 51. I think as we said before, you know, it's over 300 breaches have been mapped at surface. Only 17 are in the resource, so you know, plenty more to, to go and test. Yeah, it sounds like you've got an awful lot of work to do. So I don't want to hold you up on site too much longer. Tell me how much longer will this drilling program take place and when will we also get to see more core samples? Yeah, so at the moment, you know, the uh, drilling will continue into next year. We'll probably do a data cutoff at the end of the year to enable us to update our mineral resource estimate. And, but in the meantime, you know, you can expect uh, drill results on a regular basis. Uh, listen, Paul, this was fantastic. Thank you so much for taking us inside the core shed today. Uh, I appreciate it, but I better let you get back out to site. Thank you for being here. Uh, thanks, Shay.